Don't ask me why that light's on. Oh, he noticed. Now he wants my attention. I'm not gonna yell at him. He's not my boy to yell at or train or protect. Well, okay. The thing about me and protection is if it's in my side blind, I'll probably protect it more or less. I don't know. I feel like I was raised as a protector. Like I was raised as a protector, but internally I always feel like I'm a destroyer. Which is why I just don't do anything. Like, if you want to be destroyed, come to me. And then poke me. Until I get upset to the point where I can't reason my way out of not hurting or harming you. But most of the times, I just go with the flow. I don't care. Because none of this matters and all this matters. And it's just whatever you put forth your time and energy. Everybody has their own different stories. And everybody's going to perceive the story differently, even if we all experience the same story, the same. What's the same anymore? I don't know. I played that game called Telephone. Repeat back what you heard, and sometimes you don't hear. Or, like, draw back what you see, and sometimes people's artistic abilities don't translate to other people. So it's just like, why did they draw a perfectly great apple, and this looks like a stick? How did we get from a circle to a straight line? I don't know. But I'm willing to learn some things and other things. I don't even want to put forth the time, effort, and energy because what's it worth? And not a damn thing the second I leave. All right, time to get in the book. My opinions on everything. I don't matter, but. <laughs> How do we come to terms with those who cannot see what is possible? Well, you can't see it. Move on. For as much time and energy as I try to put in the non-believers to believe in something, they'll believe in what they want to believe, and it's not always the truth. They love me, they love me, even though they don't do any lovely thing towards you. Hey, you believe what you want to. I ain't gonna stand here and listen. How does someone with the mind of a genius come to terms with the world they live in? They cry and bitch a lot. A lot, a lot. Why do you humans have such a tendency to make things complicated? I don't fucking know. Excitement. Do people <laughs> in every society expect the world to be in to be fair? It's a great question. I don't know. I doubt it. In the terms of soul, a purely religious...